welcome back to my channel. This is Lindy, AKA Paleo Barbie, if you're new here. Uh, this is gonna be a grocery haul. So I've got a little bit from Sam's, not a big haul, and then an Aldi haul. And I, and I found some new things at Aldi that are pretty cool um, that I've never seen before at my Aldi. So we'll show you what they are as soon as I get home. All right, so we just got a small Sam's haul this time. Uh, we've uh, got some paper towels. The thick ones, we like these a lot. Um, we got another uh, jar of the creamy almond butter because this stuff is bomb, y'all. We got two jars of Rouse, some avocados because I love Sam's avocados, some uncured black forest ham. As usual, we usually always get this. Some tomatoes and some spinach. We always get that there because it's such a good deal for the organic spinach at Sam's. We got to pick up a rotisserie chicken. They have the best rotisserie chickens and the best price. Um, better than the grocery stores and then we got some more LaCroix so that is our Sam's haul not a whole lot but it's what we got and this was about $76 guys all right guys I am back from Aldi and let me show you what we got all right guys this is what we got I got two cans of smoked oysters these are actually the kind that have the cotton seed so these are not a good oil that's very inflammatory I got these for my granddaughter because she keeps eating all mine so I'm gonna let her eat these. I got some skipjack tuna. This is a really good tuna that they have at Aldi. It's wild caught, um, dolphin safe, all that. I got some garlic powder, some chicken bone broth to use for recipes, some jalapenos to use for all kinds of stuff. Um, we were out of dukes, and yes, this does have inflammatory oil in it as well, soybean oil, but it doesn't have sugar. So if you can't afford the Primal Kitchen, this is probably your best bet at the store. Um, you know, you gotta, the, this is uh, for the grandkids, the Annie's mac and cheese, some lemon juice, got some strawberries. These were on sale, I think. Uh, got a pineapple uh, for them because the, it was on sale and apples for the grandkids because it was on sale. Uh, my Aldi never hardly ever has the keto bread and they actually had the bread and the buns today and he doesn't like the bread and I don't eat these because I can't have wheat or gluten or whatever um, but uh, I'm gonna have him try the buns he probably won't like them but we'll see but we got those for him to try on hamburgers um, I got him his elevation bars and these crackers are for the kids for dinner tonight because we're making a charcuterie board um, I've got some coleslaw some Asian coleslaw mix for my tuna salad that I make some zucchini. I got mushrooms, two kinds of mushrooms. So just one pack of bacon bits because we still have some from Sam's, but I want to make sure we didn't run out. I got some baby carrots for the grandkids for snacks. I got some Parmesan crisps and some broccoli florets, frozen, three bags of those. They do have organic ones there, which, you know, organic is always best. But their organic bags are a little smaller than these, and they're $2.65, and these are 80, 89 cents or 80, 89 cents, I think. So, I mean, kind of choose your battles, I guess. Roma tomatoes, and I grabbed a few avocados because avocados are on sale, I think 39 cents each this week. And I got some of their Irish butter, some cucumbers, and some green onions. I got this because I'm using, making a recipe that I need turkey breast for, and this had really great macros. If you've not tried this brand before, I've been buying the bacon of this brand of Aldi but this is a really good one. Mm -hmm. I got some pork chops, three packs of bacon. This is the bacon I've been buying. It's no, no sugar uh, and uncured and all that good stuff. Um, so that's what I've been buying. I've been getting, or I got chicken breasts and they also this week had the chicken breast thin slice on sale. So I thought I would do some sandwiches or something with these one night grilled chicken sandwiches. This is for our charcuterie board. I have not found, unless you get like from Sprouts or Whole Foods, any kind of salami that ha doesn't have dextrose in it. Um, it's really hard to find at regular grocery stores. So um, I went ahead and got this one for tonight. And this is a new item for us. I see a lot of people um, buy, a lot of people that uh, have sh bought this. Um, my girl Keto Ginger has, buys this all the time at her Aldi in Florida. but. I've never seen it at our Aldi. It's the first time I've ever seen it. So I'm excited to get it and try it and make some, um, you know, some yummy subs in a tub with this. 
this is another new item. I wasn't really going to get ground beef today, but they had these half price. So Aldi does this all the time. They have like half price items in the meat section that are new items or that are just on sale, like manager special. And so that's what this was this week. Uh, and so I went ahead and got three packs because this is a really good brand of ground beef. I picked up some ground turkey because I want to make Nicole Burgess's uh, sausage recipe for breakfast. And this is the kind they have. So that's what I got. I also got some cheese for our charcuterie board. I got some mild cheddar, some white cheddar, and then I got this e Ed Edom. This one was in our um, cheese advent calendar and it was really good, so I got one of those. And then I got the regular blocks that we normally get, mozzarella and cheddar, two of those each, and then a pepper jack. And I also got some Italian style shred, some Munster shred, and I thought I had a cheddar shred somewhere. And here is a mild cheddar, some mild cheddar slices. Oh, there's the cheddar, cheddar shred. My little helper here is moving everything as I talk. And this is a new item for us. I've never seen this. Um, I have seen, I've seen the uh, grilling cheese before in a whole like block, but I've never seen this. So this is the same thing. Um, but it's already sliced up so you can make like fries with it and I thought it would be fun to try one night um, With something like a burger or something Or just to have for a snack, so we'll get that we got that um, And I think I, I don't think I talked about these goat cheese Some sliced gouda and then some almond milk unsweetened almond milk so that is my haul, guys. I've got uh, a few non-keto items just because the grandkids and also, um, well, mostly the grandkids. <laughs> anyway, so that's my haul. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you like this uh, grocery haul, and I will see you guys in the next video. If you haven't liked and subscribed already, please do so. It really helps out my channel. I will see you guys later.